If you have self-hatred, you perceive that the universe is mean to you and you also treat yourself badly because part of your software does not really buy into you. It thinks this thing that you are is very flawed and should not really be supported. So if you don't like yourself, you are going to punish yourself in some sense, which means your mind is going to create a simulation in which reality treats yourself badly. This will sometimes lead to bad outcomes, sometimes it might lead to better ones. There is a reason why your mind thinks this is the best setup. But uh, this identification that you have with your beliefs and your experiences is something that's generated inside of your mind. This identification with what you feel, what you experience, can become your choice. So I can I can simulate a self-hatred state or I can simulate a self-love state. You could also uh, get to a neutral state in which you realize that all these evaluations that you put on there where you think that you are super lovable or super flawed are uh, actually not helpful or not truthful. And you just are. You're just a physical system. You're not in the category of things that has the ability to be adequate or inadequate. You just exist and you deal with that.